Hey guys, a quick video um, on shift change and also restocking checklists at night. Um, this is actually very important, so when you leave in the afternoon, you are setting up the night people properly by cleaning and restocking everything that's needed. Um, this list should also be done um, if you are a somebody that works at night and you get off about an hour before we close. You also are required to use this sheet and this also helps the closers out so they're not having to do all the work in the, the night. So um, it's called their restocking checklist. And again, we do, do this as shift change and also if you're leaving about an hour before close, they kind of go through these things. Um, you want to wipe down all countertops and bev air. Use a clean towel. Clean and straighten up slab area. It needs to be spotless. Restock all ice cream mixins, cups and cones. So if you look at the mixing jars and the Oreos and sprinkles and all that things are low, we need to restock those. If you see any ice cream pans, you see the bottom of the pan, we want to restock that as well. And then all the cups on the counter, we need to restock those. Uh, we also need to restock all the spoons and napkins. Please wipe down the containers as you are uh, restocking those. We want to go to the lobby and we want to wipe down all the tables, table bases, crowd control poles, and trash cans. We want to sweep the lobby if possible. That might be tough, but do your best. Only when there's no customers. Um, you can sweep behind the counter, behind the service counter. You want to um, check the bathrooms for cleanliness. Now on the pre-close checklist, an hour before, we need to clean the restroom. So this might apply to you as well. Um, all dishes need to be um, done and restocked before you leave. Also, workbench should be clean and spotless and everything should be put away. And then lastly, just check with your shift leader to ask if there's anything else you can do. Now, ideally, both these things, you don't want to wait till you get off your shift to start it. So if your shift ends at 5, start this list at 4.45 if you're able to. If you get off at 10 o'clock, start this list at 9.45 if you're able to, to get some of these items knocked out. Obviously, if you want to ask somebody to help you with this list, that is perfectly okay. Now, if you have to stay past your time, your clock out time, you need to stay past your clock out time to get these things done. You can't leave until the, uh, these items get done. Um, so that is the restocking checklist for your shift change and for those that are non-closers. Thank you.